This video is sponsored by Caleb and Brown. They help their clients buy, sell, and swap cryptocurrencies with a 24-7 personal broker service. Sign up today. So again, first step, recent research reveals increased Bitcoin ownership among Americans. That's right, 20% of American adults reportedly hold at least one cryptocurrency, and Bitcoin's price increase is influenced by upcoming elections and institutional interests. Spot Bitcoin ETFs have experienced significant demand and growth this year, and yeah, they've definitely grown a lot. I think beginning of this year, we were like at the $20,000, $30,000 Bitcoin. So literally, if you got there at the beginning of the year, you tripled your money by just holding on to Bitcoin. So let's go through this article and learn a little bit more about just Americans holding on to it. So a study conducted by the Consumer Financial Institution indicates that approximately 20% of American adults own at least one cryptocurrency. The latest research sheds more light on why Bitcoin is gaining prominence ahead of the 2024 U.S. presidential election. With just three weeks until the election, Bitcoin's price rose by 3.8% in the last 24 hours, positioning, positioning it as the 10th largest asset globally, according to CoinMarketCap data. Bitcoin market's capitalization has reached $1.34 trillion right now, and that could definitely increase so much more. But reasons behind the Bitcoin price surge is that in recent days, Bitcoin has climbed to a three-month high, experiencing double-digit growth on a weekly basis. This surge occurring as the U.S. elections approach has led to speculations that Bitcoin price may be linked to the election cycle. Similar price movements were observed during 2016 and 2020 elections. So again, it's following the cycles and like we knew this was going to happen. Some people are going like, think like, really? It's like, you're basing your judgment on that. It's like, it, Bitcoin's still brand new. It's like, Bitcoin's been around like 14, 15 years now. Like it's the teenage years and it's just following what it's done. But as the cryptocurrency industry gains focus ahead of the 2024 elections, public statements from figures like Donald Trump and Kamala Harris supporting cryptocurrencies have impacted the market. Trump's positive stance toward the crypto industry and Harris's promise of proper regulations have boosted market confidence, contributing to Bitcoin's price increase. Now, rising demand for Bitcoin ETFs out there are also rising. The demand for the spot Bitcoin ETF has emerged as a significant factor, driving the increase in Bitcoin's price approved earlier this year. These ETFs have gained popularity, surpassing $19 billion in net flows, and this surge in demand supports the upward trend of Bitcoin's price. Alongside the growing interest from institutional investors, the size of CME open positions has reached record levels, indicating that professional investors expect more Bitcoin. Mm -hmm. Now, the S&P 500 index opening at a new peak levels and expectations for October have also positively influenced Bitcoin's price. October is recognized as the most profitable month over the past 13 years and with a strong start. Bitcoin prices are rising once again. A report from CoinGlass indicates a monthly growth rate of 6.83%. Now, October didn't start off so strong. We were like going, oh, are we in Rectober, which a lot of people wanted because we wanted to fill our bags more, some other altcoins. And again, this is an altcoins time right now. This is Bitcoin's time. Like once Bitcoin maybe reaches like 80,000, 90,000, then we'll be seeing at least a big uptick in altcoins. So this is really like your last chance to get in on that. I think I was listening to Alex Becker today and he was even saying, yeah, this is your last chance to get into these altcoins before prices goes crazy. Now, significant investments in Bitcoin by major companies like MicroStrategy also enhance investor confidence. Additionally, firms such as MetaPlanet and Tesla expanding their Bitcoin portfolios bolster market trust. Now, Tesla just moved their Bitcoin, I covered that article yesterday, that day, like their 11,500 Bitcoin that they have to an unknown wallet. So it's still speculative right now. Like, are they still going to be holding it? Is that their wallet? We don't know. So we're just paying for that. But MetaPlanet, because of their following the Bitcoin MicroStrategy plan, their stocks have increased because of it. Now, the continuation of this price increase will depend on election outcomes and market dynamics. Investors remain vigilant, monitoring Bitcoin's performance alongside institutional support and regulatory developments. Now, is there any more news on that? No, nope, but those are just a lot of the just conditions for why Bitcoin's rising. Institutional investors, micro strategy, the ETFs that came beforehand, we're in October, uh, presidential elections, we're just following our cycle, but like this is that time. So again, this is your last chance to get in, enjoy the ride, and yeah, let's keep going Bitcoin. So